Brittany, I have loved you from the very second I laid eyes on you seven years ago. I knew there was always something so incredibly special about you. And I'm very grateful that the Lord has brought us back together and allowed us to have such a wonderful life. It blows me away to look back on life and realize that you were there all along. My love for you will continue to grow day by day, minute by minute. I don't think I could actually ever put into words how much I love you uh, because it's an indescribable feeling. My dearest Adam, today marks our greatest adventure yet. We continually prayed and kept the Lord between the two of us. We've traveled, we've celebrated, and just about everything together in the last two years. I've never gone a single day wondering if I made the right choice in spending the rest of my life with you. But I also never thought I'd meet someone like you. But today is my favorite day of all. From this day, I give you my whole heart. I thank God daily that he created you for me and made you into such a godly man. Adam is, as you guys know, he's he's very positive and bright and he's always wanted to, he's always needed someone to share that brightness and love with and I can't say anything enough for Brittany to be there with him and enjoy the rest of their life with each other. Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you that you're the author and the sustainer of marriage and it was your idea, this estate that you have granted to man. You said it was not good that man should be alone. And today, Lord, I thank you that this precious couple comes together to declare their love before you and before these witnesses as you will cause them to become one. And we are witnesses to this amazing miracle but of the hand of God. Brittany, my beautiful, strong, and caring daughter, you make such a beautiful bride. You're gorgeous. You couldn't look more stunning. Remember the love that has been poured into you by your family and friends and use that love to lift up your husband with all the love and respect you have received from your friends and family. We are so proud of the loving and caring woman you have become and may God continue and bless you as the start of your new journey today. Uh, I want you to know that I love you and I'm excited to marry you. I actually never thought that I'd see this day and I'd especially marry you. I'm very privileged for that. And uh, the fact that everything's kind of happened the way it happened makes me really, really excited. But um, I'm excited to see you, I miss you, and I can't wait to see you, baby, I love you. So when Brittany began dating Adam, you know, we could tell it was something that was really, really special. Adam pulled me to the side. You know, he promised me that he would give Brittany nothing but the love, respect that we all know she deserves. And then he looked me straight in the eyes and told me that he was going to marry her. And yet here we are, not, <laughs> not too long later. I can say Adam is a man of his word. He said he was going to do something and he did it. Adam, I know you will treat Brittany with nothing but love and respect. You will care for her the way that she deserves, and I cannot ask for a better groom for my best friend. Um, she's a tremendous person. Um, most, most of all, I think she brings out the best in Adam. So we're very, very happy to be welcoming her into our family. I can't wait to marry you. Um, and I'm such a good wife to you. The best decision Adam's ever made was uh, deciding that he wanted to spend the rest of his life with Brittany. <laughs> and uh, I, I couldn't be any more supportive of it. Adam. You may now kiss your bride. Sunshine, I promise to love you always. I promise to care for you unconditionally. I promise to always be your best friend. 
I promise to love you through tears and laughter. I promise to never lose hope. I promise to honor and comfort you. I promise to continue loving everything about you. Everything you do for us will always be greatly appreciated and it always will be. I cannot wait to continue loving you for a lifetime. Love is a choice and I choose you. I love you, Brittany, today, tomorrow, and forever. Thank you for choosing a movie. Someone who will be an amazing husband, father, and a best friend. Someone who is infuriatingly headstrong and always positive. You always see the silver linings and the best that life has to offer. I am so proud that you will be able to forever call you my husband. I guess it's about time for me to believe that I have the privilege to marry you. I look forward to being completely infatuated, smitten, and devoted to you for the rest of my life. I promise to always love you, defend you, protect you, and be the best wife to you. Yesterday, you guys were individuals. Uh, today, you still have your individuality, but you became one, okay? You're stronger together. You're a married couple. Uh, you're going to face ups, downs, victories, and defeats. Um, just be together, because you guys together can accomplish anything. For our entire relationship, you know, I feel like I entered our relationship, you know, devoting my everything to making sure his life is my everything. His life is happy. His life is fulfilled. His life is whatever Beth wanted it to be. What was crazy is that I didn't realize it until I had my own kids that I, that not only was I raising him, but when I had my own kids that I realized that he was raising me to be a mom. You both have been there for me through so much and I'm looking forward to the future with you guys and someday I'll be there and you guys will be next to me getting married and I am so looking forward to it. My biggest responsibility, however, is to represent my dearest friend Beth, his mama. Beth, with the help of Rudy, has left us all a legacy of truly special young men. They're all wonderful husbands, joyful fathers, and let's not pretend to not notice how handsome they are. I speak mostly to you, Brittany, as I talk about my friend Beth. The things that were most important for her to instill in her boys all the things are all the things that will make Adam an exceptional husband. She led and taught by example, always thoughtful, going the extra mile in all situations, loyal to all of those around her, loyal to her work, her church, her family, her friends. So, so kind and so generous, even when she didn't have very much to give. Please value each other's needs and wants with respect and appreciation and understanding. Always trust each other, believe in each other. God loves you. All the people around here love you both so much. 
And Grandma loves you very dearly. Wherever I am, far or near, I'll always be here for you. And I'll always love you with all my heart and soul. God bless you both so much. We love you.